عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome back to another video of the How to Action Verb series Today we are going to take How to Deduce The verb deduce means to make the necessary reasoning by referring to the documents and results in order to reach a conclusion So deduce as we all know Yes, it, it is a conclusion, but uh, by first making the necessary reasoning, maybe by analysis, interpretation, conclude, uh, comparing, anything that depends on the document that we have and the results that we got in order to reach the conclusion. Always remember, if you didn't do this reasoning, the necessary reasoning, your answer will be graded zero because the deduce, the verb deduce, cannot be accepted the answer of it without this reason. In order to practice on deduction, we have here an experiment or exercise. The introduction of the exercise says, an experiment was done in order to study the importance of mechanical digestion. Here, as we know, this is the objective. We want to know the importance of mechanical digestion. The conditions and results of the experiment are shown in the following table. Let's see the table together. We have two tubes. We have in uh, these tubes, both tubes, we have 10 grams of meat. But in tube A, it's cut and it's in one piece, the meat. While in tube B, it's cut into small pieces. The enzyme used for both tubes is pepsin. The temperature is 37 degrees Celsius. The pH is acidic in both tubes. Uh, while the result here that we needed one hour for the complete digestion in tube A, but in tube B we needed 30 minutes. Okay, it's very clear here that the manipulated factor is the aspect of the meat and the size of the meat pieces. Here the meat was in one piece, but in B it was cut into small pieces. Now why did we do that? Why did we cut it in small pieces? Remember we wanted to study the importance of mechanical digestion which is, uh, for example, in the body, the mastication, chewing, or churning of the stomach, which cuts the food that we eat into small pieces. So we wanted to resemble this mechanical digestion in vitro in the lab, so we got a piece of meat and we cut it into small pieces as if we are making mechanical digestion to it. Now, the question here is, did you use the importance of mechanical digestion of food? So what is the importance of mechanical digestion? Now, some of you could, uh, for example, just give the answer directly. This is very wrong. We have, as we said, the verb deduce. We have to uh, give the reasoning from the table, from the result of the experiment. Then we can uh, give our answer. Now, let's see how to answer this question. The meat that was cut into small pieces to be here, needed a period of time to be completely digested 30 minutes shorter than that of meat in one piece in tube a one hour notice how we said that it is here the time is shorter than in tube a we wanted to show it's correct that they both were digested but this took shorter time than tube b took shorter time uh, and of course this is related to the, the shape of the pieces now, after we've done comparison, here starts the conclusion. Therefore, we use the word therefore. Mechanical digestion facilitates. Mechanical digestion, the word facilitates means it makes it easier and speeds it up, makes it quicker, took less time. So here is the importance of mechanical digestion. Thanks for your attention and goodbye.